The city of Chicago has implemented a comprehensive hiring freeze across all city departments, including police and fire, in response to a projected $1 billion budget shortfall through 2025. The city faces a $982.4 million gap for fiscal year 2025 and an additional $222.9 million deficit expected by the end of 2024. The budget shortfall is attributed to several factors, including a decrease in state personal property replacement tax revenue, rising personnel, pension and contractual costs, and an unexpected payment of $175 million reimbursement to Chicago Public Schools for pension contributions. The police department, already short by about 2,000 sworn officers, now faces additional staffing challenges due to the hiring freeze. The fire department's $664 million budget deficit is affected, potentially exacerbating existing shortages of paramedics and ambulances. Concerns have been raised about the impact on public safety, with some officials emphasizing the need to prioritize essential services. The city has halted all new interviews and consensus meetings effective immediately. Additional measures include strict limitations on non-essential travel and overtime expenditures outside of public safety operations. Mayor Brandon Johnson faces a delicate balancing act as he campaigned on a pledge to avoid property tax hikes. However, the severity of the budget shortfall has reignited discussions about potential tax increases, with the looming $1 billion deficit for 2025 casting a shadow over the city's financial future. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Lauren Taylor. For more unbiased straight fact reporting, download the Straight Arrow News app.